Embryonic stem cell research has been grabbing headlines since the president decided to allow federally funded research this week. But some doctors oversee claim they've already made amazing steps forward. Doctors here are warning patients to beware. Africa and Mexico and gosh, the world. I just, I love traveling. Jennifer Blankenship spent her life traveling the world, but it was on this trip to Costa Rica for a new medical procedure that she says changed her life. A trip her brother documented on home video. Jennifer is getting physical therapy. Blankenship has multiple sclerosis. About two years ago, she developed trouble speaking and was partially paralyzed. But she says an injection of stem cells into her spine changed everything. As soon as I had an injection, I was speaking normally. And then uh, I started wiggling all my toes and my hands and raising both my arms above my head, which I hadn't done in years. The procedure is unique because it doesn't use embryonic stem cells. Instead, doctors use stem cells donated from umbilical cord blood or tissues donated after a miscarriage so-called adult stem cells. Those stem cells then get around those nerves and start to help rebuild the, uh, the coating around the nerves. But top U.S. researchers say that doesn't make sense. Adult stem cells, they say, just don't work that way. Doctors say this procedure is not being done in the U.S. and they're suspect of overseas clinics who promise stem cell miracle cures. People have heard about stem cells. They think that something miraculous can happen if somebody simply injects a stem cell into them or waves it at them. Uh, it's going to take a number of years of research before we have treatment for really serious diseases like multiple sclerosis, spinal cord injury, Parkinson's disease, diabetes. Still, Jennifer believes it did help her and hopes further stem cell treatments might help her walk one day. The seasoned traveler says if she has to go to the ends of the world to make it happen, she's up for the adventure. I think uh, the world is the limit. And researchers tell us they have noticed an uptick in foreign clinics offering so-called stem cell miracle cures. And they're not cheap, charging anywhere from twenty to $60,000 for procedures like the one that Jennifer had. One researcher that we spoke to told us he sees dozens of patients who've had awful side effects, including deadly tumors, after being injected with stem cells overseas. Now, researchers stressed that this really isn't cutting-edge mm -hmm. technology, Robin. They say this is pretty much snake oil, yeah, so right. beware. Beware. Great debate. All right, Sharon, thanks so much.